I'm here with Darren from DPRD, and Darren, you've got a very special car in front of us, a very beautiful car in front of us. Tell us, what are we looking at here? Well, this is a replica of what Ayrton Senna would have driven in the 1979 World Championships. It's called a GP79. It was an evolution of the 78, which came before. And um, yeah, we've had it about six, seven years now. I've taken it to many demos and it won the concourse here a few years ago, I think 2017. But it's as close as I can get it, finding all the period parts. And that's been the hardest challenge along the way. But yeah. it was a wreck when we found it. We had to restore a lot of things like the side pod bar, uh, rails or the side rails, they were all missing and they all had to be refabricated. And my friend Pete, who we do the fabrication with, did all that with us. And yeah, it's a dream to drive as well. I'm really, really lucky to own it. <laughs> I mean, it is absolutely fabulous. And it's got those few quirky things compared to some of the same sort of carts in the in the era. Talking about sort of the frame, things that Ayrton um, developed in terms of the frame. We've got yeah. sort of the, 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 the V-bars yeah. in the middle. As the story goes, apparently that was something that he either was involved with or insisted that they were welded in. And some people that were more experienced than the team, like Terry Fullerton and the others, didn't agree perhaps. And... Yeah, there was, there was something about a story with that, but a bit before my time. And um, yeah, it's, uh, it's all come together really nicely now. And also I wanted to do it in the, the DAP factory color, which was red. Yeah. So many people have done lots of center replicas, quite rightly in the green color, mm -hmm. which was the car he used at the Worlds was a green one. But there's, apparently there's a story attached to that, that that was because he borrowed a green one from the Australian team. <laughs> and that was their national colors. Yes, But of DAP factory was red. So yeah. that was why I wanted to do a red one. And, yeah, it's been a lovely car to own. And, and here it is. And like I say, driving this this weekend, and you've already driven it so far this weekend. Bit of a handful, isn't it? It's Yeah, it doesn't want to go into corners like normal cars. You don't turn it into a corner. You, you just have to back it in. You have yeah. to lock the rear brake and slide the car in. But... Yeah, they were they were heroes. Them guys. But, but that yeah, but like we say, that's proper driving. That is it, n none of this. Oh, when it's set up so it's glued to the track, it just goes round. You've got to back it in. You've got to yeah. lock the rear, yeah. get it in sideways. That's the sort of style that we need. It would be hugely frowned upon now if you were to go and speak to any other team <laughs> managers over here or ever. They would all be like, "Oh no, you're losing time." It's but yeah. you try. You put one of the modern lads in this. It would take him a long time to adapt. He would yeah. get it. He would yeah. get it. But it's 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 not easy. It's a bit of a handful. And with the slide carburetor as well it's so responsive it's yeah. um it's just like instant there's no lag there's no power valve yeah. it's now, just all there now one thing that i'm sure the camera can pick up now darren if you press that throttle yeah. for me please have a look at the car straight in there ladies and gents no air filter none of that it's straight air into it and of course if you're on a marbles anything uh, yeah yeah any, uh, <laughs> yeah and it's literally in my uh, in my race suit pocket i've got a rag that i keep in there in between runs just to stop little bits of debris sitting in there you get a bit of grit in the slide it could jam so yeah yeah i mean it was probably sent so i mean a modern, modern rotax today has a slide carburetor but it's all hidden it's all behind the, the air filters and everything but um yeah it's I, that's the first time this year that i've driven it on the slide carburetor right and it's Yes, it's just an animal. It's totally different. <laughs> an absolute handful. But I have to say, absolutely beautiful. And I love it when we come around to see, you know, carts that have been replicated, brought back, you know, because it does, it, it makes, uh, you know, drivers see what it used to be yeah. like in those sort of eras. Because, yes, they could come around and see any one of these carts and think, oh, yeah, that was it. But Senna, probably one of the biggest names yeah. in motor racing, in modern motor racing well, back in the day. he on the map, really. He did, he so, did. Yeah, he, he was one of the first to say karting's the way to go if you yeah. want to go forward. And and he was a huge hero of mine so um yeah that was where it all came from no but it's absolutely fantastic well darren thank you very much for having a chat no with problem. us and uh, yeah. i might have to sit around and look at this for a little bit longer it'll be out this afternoon and it'll be out tomorrow as well brilliant there all we right. go make sure you check it out thank you